One of Stanford's bodyguards got a videotape of Mike Cingalini's funeral from a Philadelphia TV station. Skinny Joey Merlino struck first. A month after he was wounded, Merlino supposedly ignored the rule against involving family members in mob violence and allegedly ordered John Stanford's son murdered. 23-year-old Joe Stanford was shot in the head while caught in traffic on a Philadelphia highway. He survived, but it sent his father reeling. Not surprisingly, Stanford demanded retribution. The old man was very upset, and his son just got shot in the head. And he was very distraught, and he said uh, to Philip, I want you to go out and kill this guy and kill his son. So John Vesey went out and murdered a member of the Merlino faction, Frankie Baldino. To the police, it was just one more corpse in the ongoing gangland war. But not for Vesey. It would be the hitman's last kill on behalf of the mob. His next target would be the boss himself.